Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to a new vlog. Today we are starting to shoot the special project that's gonna go up in July, keeping it under wraps until then. But I did not sleep well. <laughs> I did not sleep well. I was just like thinking about everything. I kept waking up and like writing things down to remember. And it's just been like a crazy couple days. I was gonna vlog yesterday, like doing some prep but I was, I was just really busy, so I don't know. I thought I'd pick up the vlog, vlog a little bit for what I can, just because I'm trying to keep up the content, even though we're busy. But I should have showed you guys taking out the blowout preservation. This is my best one yet. I am absolutely astounded with how good they came out. I had them, I had three mohawk rolls with the socks with the bendy things in there and oh my gosh like the volume <laughs> is crazy full-on blowout I think I'm gonna wear it like to the side and I was trying to like think of how I want to do my hair for the next week I have it freshly washed last night I gave myself a blowout did the little preservation I'm gonna wash my face while we're while we're talking here because like I'm gonna want to wear like some sort of a different hairstyle every day that we're filming. So I was like, okay, I'll start off with like a straight style. At some point I'll switch over to curls, I think. It's just been so much. That was like a little detail I didn't, didn't really think of. But we're heading to the Airbnb to start shooting in, this afternoon. So this morning, everything's pretty much ready to go, I think. Yesterday I got mostly everything done. We have to go pick up like a huge BJ's order. Basically just load up the car. I've got a ton of stuff to load up. I'm so nervous. And I know this is probably so annoying because you're like, what are you talking about? I just like really want it to be a surprise next month. But um, it's been all consuming, but I think it's gonna just be like a very, very fun week. Also you guys, I wanted to let you know that these face towel things, the ones I got on Amazon, they're like identical to the Clean Skin Club ones. So if you can't get your hands on the Clean Skin Club ones, these are like identical. I don't know if they're cheaper or not. I'll link them down below. But they really do work very well, wet and dry. And I don't want to be presumptuous here, but I feel like they're already helping my skin get a little more clear. I do typically use like a washcloth. So like I'm not using like a dirty towel or anything. I just feel like these work different for some reason. I've also got all my nice clean makeup brushes. So I've got nice fresh makeup vibes for this week. I've also really been liking the Olay moisturizer that I got, the niacinamide peptide one. It smells really good. And you guys will have to let me know what's your favorite like tinted moisturizer because I have this Fair Minerals one, Complexion Rescue Natural Matte Tinted Moisturizer. It has SPF 30, and I do like it, actually. I do feel like it adds like the most subtle bit of coverage with, you know, having SPF. I'm just curious if you guys have a favorite tinted SPF, so let me know. I'm gonna wait and do my makeup like as close as I can before we leave, just so it stays fresh. But I also have to pack like a touch-up bag because for the next week we'll be like out early and home late. So I wanna make sure I have like a good touch-up bag. Oh, and then this is fun. I like plucked a random stray hair I had right here. And I've had this mark for days. And I had to get blood drawn. This happened. I'm a sensitive girly. <laughs> now when we're filming, I'm gonna be like awkwardly holding my arm. <laughs> Just trying to like hide it. <laughs> Keep my arms bent. <laughs> Several days later. Hello vlog. <laughs> I'm checking in with my sweet vlog friends because I have not checked in in days. We are halfway through shooting. I am so beat. We're in a rental suburban today because we needed to drive a lot of people. But it's going really well. The project is like, I'm just so excited to show you guys next month. Um, me and Yar and my mom, it's a three man show. <laughs> um, you know, we're hoping, hoping that if we do this again, we can hire help. 
because it's been a lot, but overall it couldn't have gone any better. I just wanted to do a check-in clip because, you know, let you guys know how we're doing. I love this dress. It's so cute, but we have a really fun day ahead and uh, that's the update. Several days later. We finished the project this morning. We're beat. We're beat. My new camera came in the mail. This is my first clip on the new camera. <sighs> we just tried to take a nap. We couldn't fall asleep. Nope. Because, like, we're too keyed up. But we did it. Yeah. We just keep looking at each other and being like, we did it. And you guys will know more next month, but. Feels good. I want to go get Bruno. We're tired. I miss Bruno so much. He's been at camp. He's been at his camp having fun with dogs, but I miss that boy. Dibwow! <laughs> I was just quiet without him. Too quiet. But we're done. We did it. Just want to show you guys this. After a week of completely ignoring these tulips, I am shocked. <laughs> finally, finally done with filming. And they stood straight up. Even though they are dead, I put a penny in the bottom because I saw that on TikTok to get your tulips to stand straight up. We'd come home late at night and I would be like amazed every night. I'm like, I don't even have a second to change the water on these. They stood straight up from the penny. Isn't that insane? That's different. Like, That's it different. actually worked. That is a hack. I feel like, dude, my voice is so gone from last night. Mine is shot. Right? After we wrapped the project last night, we all went out and like my voice is gone. And they're dead. They're totally dead. But they're standing up straight. <laughs> yeah, that's where we're at. Soft God. Yeah, I mean, honestly, such a great hack. It stands them straight up. It's, wow, okay. <laughs> All right, I just opened some PR packages. Look at this cute little travel set from Laura Mercier. It's so cute. It's not like three little travel bags. This little baby translucent powder, little caviar eye stick, lipstick, primers. Great for travel. It's just a sign that we need to travel somewhere. And then Salt Air sent their new body mists. I put this one on immediately because it matches my shirt and it smells amazing. This one was Pink Beach. It is with notes of, I can't really read it, creamy coconut, almond blossom, and vanilla. It smells insanely good. I'll try these another day. Um, and then Not Your Mother sent me some stuff, some dry shampoo, sea salt spray, great for summer, and then some blonde toning shampoo and conditioner so thank you guys i'm so grateful and y'all look at this hold on then my other flowers these are the ones that yar got me for um our anniversary and like i didn't change the water on these either because guys when i tell you we would we were working like 15 16 hour days these um are almost <laughs> still perfect like how so that's kind of funny um i guess they just uh had a stronger stronger willpower <laughs> i don't know but at least they look cute still so we have just been cleaning bringing things in from the car putting things away we have just so much random stuff left from the week <laughs> i don't even know what's in here oh my gosh pineapple rum what is this one coconut rum this was left over from the bartender we hired spiced rum so we can have that leftover stuff here just so much, so, <laughs> just some croissants. I thought, I thought um, someone took that. Oh, and then this was in the car. Uh-oh, babe, we should have brought these in. Just a bunch of meat and cheese. <laughs> I've been out there for like two hours. Two hours, I don't four know. Two hours, maybe. Well, <laughs> two hours, maybe four. That nap we took felt like 10 minutes. The nap we took felt like 10 minutes, but I think it was a bit longer. <laughs> so, um, also, if you guys have a BJ's, this salsa was absolutely phenomenal. And also, I don't know what this vlog is. I'm just trying to keep the vlogs going. See, that's my husband. <laughs> that's Yarman in a nutshell. <laughs> I put down anything and it's always it's always like this. <laughs> and then he's always like, no. <laughs> no, no, no. We need to be careful. No. So we got the new we got the is new C V one camera. Z V is a CV two now? Z V one Mark II. Okay. Generation two. That's my vlog camera, if you guys want a good vlog camera wreck. A few moments later. Okay, just like a funny little tidbit here. <laughs> we were like so excited to look at the footage on the new camera that we got. And we're like, why is it so grainy? But we had like a filter on and that's meant for outside and we are inside. 
so the last couple clips we took like were not as good as they should have been but yes hopefully this looks better but i really like this camera too because it's on the tripod right now and they changed it so that you can take out your sd card without having to take it off the tripod and if you you know vlog or whatever you will know how annoying it is to have to take your camera off the off the tripod just to remove your sd card or change the battery and i know that sounds probably small but it's like a really big game changer so loving that we put most of the stuff away some of it i'm just gonna like wait till tomorrow because whew, we are pooped but it's six o'clock now as we mentioned or as i mentioned bruno is at um we call it camp but <laughs> he's at boarding um he went to boarding um, while we were shooting this last week just because we were gone all day every day um and we didn't want to neglect him and he loves it so we got lots of pictures of him playing there and he had a really good time i like really miss him though i like wanted to go pick him up tonight but like they have specific times you can do pickups and i was like not gonna make it so i can't wait to pick him up tomorrow <laughs> i miss my boy it's like the longest i've been away from him in a really long time like the training he did in the beginning was the longest i'd been away from him but i haven't been away from him this long in like a minute so it's gonna be really nice to see him tomorrow and i'm just gonna try to get back in the groove tomorrow <sighs> like if i wake up and feel energized enough i'd really like to go to the gym i haven't i did not go to the gym during all this time <laughs> when i tell you yara and i and my mom this last week this is just me kind of reflecting a little bit without like giving anything away we we got up most days around like six and we didn't get home until usually like 10 and then we would import footage at night and try to unwind and like try to fall asleep. We were so like excited every night and like we were importing the footage and just being so excited. And I know I'm so repetitive in this vlog about how I feel bad that like I can't like share it yet because I just really want it to be an exciting surprise next month. But um, I'll shut up about it after this vlog. <laughs> I will shut up um, and the normal vlogs will resume. But overall, I'm just like, if you were part of the project and you're watching, I love you and that's suspicious. That was an inside joke we had over the week. Um, but overall, it was just an absolutely incredible week and oh my gosh, I'm so excited to dive into editing that's gonna like consume my life next, but it's gonna be really fun to relive uh, the last week and just really put a fun twist on the editing process, you know? So. Anyway, that's my little check-in. It's six o'clock now. We are ordering dinner. I'm like, well, let's just make our life easy. I need to clean out the fridge, y'all. <laughs> I open the fridge and I'm like, ooh, no stinky. It's funny, like one, you could take one week and just like not do much and it's gonna stink, the fridge. I, I We don't even have a lot in there. It's gotta be the baby spinach. Like we have a box of baby spinach. It's gotta be that box of baby spinach. But throughout the week, like we left dishes, like we just, we were in pure survival mode like the house looked looked a mess so um i'm glad we got it kind of under control here bruno is also going to get groomed tomorrow afternoon we found a really good routine with his groomer now which is nice and he gets so stinky after he goes i don't know why we call it camp i like calling it camp if you hear me say that that's what i mean he gets so stinky after camp because like he's just playing in dirt playing with dogs um like i'm glad he's having a good time but It'd be a perfect day to do grooming too because we also need to have him like a little bit trimmed trying to keep him at the perfect length so we'll bring him there tomorrow and i'm also just like really behind on normal work stuff i also like kind of haven't really realized that it's summer <laughs> like hi it's kind of just like summer all of a sudden the place we were at had a pool and I didn't get a chance to swim just because we were busy, but um, now I'm just like craving a pool day. So I want my mom and I go to the pool that we found last summer. We found like a place where we go and we get day passes for the pool. So definitely craving a pool day. I'm gonna look at the weather actually, hold on. Oh, that's actually, that's actually comical. The 10 day forecast has like rain and clouds. That, that's, the, that's the universe and God telling me to focus on editing right now. He's like, get this done first. Um, but yeah, okay. We're gonna chill. We're gonna watch a new Apple TV show because we're, we're done with our shows right now. We're gonna start the show called Platonic on Apple TV Plus with Seth Rogen um, and just have a good have a good giggle. I think we both, I think me and Yara need a, <laughs> need a good giggle. So, all right, I will check in with you guys tomorrow.
tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. It's going to pick up Bruno day. I'm so excited. Oh, I just like cannot wait. Like he's gonna go crazy. I'm gonna go crazy. And I'm just so, so excited. So hopefully we got all of our camera things situated, but it's so nice to have the new camera. My old one at one point, <laughs> Bruno had got it. It had bite marks on it. The battery, I was rocking an old camera that hardly worked. <laughs> like literally bite marks, the little battery thing would hardly open. The lens would only open halfway. I'd have to like open it with my fingers. <laughs> But I'm so I'm loving this camera so far so I think once you get a new camera it's always a little bit of like gotta figure this out you know what I mean like it's always kind of figuring out new settings and stuff like that so but anyway we're gonna go get Bruno we're gonna grab breakfast before Yar has to work he's going to work the day after the project I'm like you are you're amazing that's a lot it's a lot so we we also like we we're having a hard time sleeping I think just because it was such a crazy week we're just like I don't know we're having a hard time with like sleeping getting back in the groove but anyway we're gonna go get bruno oh and another fun update we are we have like you know how we have all rocks underneath our deck in the backyard we are having that done today we wish we kind of did that from the beginning if you do new construction that's something like to think about you know we thought we wouldn't mind the rocks but if you have like a dog or anything go for the like the concrete pour <laughs> Yeah, that was an option. Um, it was obviously more expensive and we just didn't think it mattered, but we're having the rocks removed today and putting like just a cute little, um, I don't even know the word for it, like kind of cement tile situation put down. They said it was a one day job, so hopefully I can show you guys later, but I'm not, I'm not sure. Uh, so if not, you'll see it in the next vlog, but they just got here and they are starting. Um, so yeah, let's go, let's go get Bruno. Well, well, well. Look who's at home. Look who's here. He said, hi guys. Hi guys. Hi you two people. Are you happy to be home? Are you happy to be home? We are so happy. We missed you so much. He's never cried like the way he did when we picked him up today. He just was like, we both, honestly, we both just whined and cried and held each other. I should have recorded it, but I was in a moment. I was in a moment. I teared up because I missed you so much. I missed you so much. Oh my god, he, you a stinky boy. <laughs> he smells so bad. <laughs> um, his grooming appointment's not for a few hours. But that's okay, that's okay. Oh my god, y'all, the backyard, <laughs> the backyard. It's a little awkward because <laughs> the guy who's doing the patio, <laughs> the day he came to give us a quote, he was like, don't worry, we won't mess up your lawn. <laughs> just where the machine has to like turn the corner around the gate he's like that's the only part like your grass will get a little messed up you might just have to throw down some seed i just looked outside half the backyard is destroyed i'm not gonna say anything like it's not their fault but like i just wish he would have like told me you know like because he really downplayed it i feel like to get us to like sign with him <laughs> And like I understand it's inevitable, but like he literally was like one little part. I'm telling you guys, it's like half the lawn. Half the grass is just gone. And we worked so hard to get our grass like growing from nothing last year. <laughs> just wait till you guys see it. I'll show you later. It's like I look back, just I'm like, oh I'm a little sneak peek, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> but anyway, hopefully the patio is worth it. I mean, Yara and I were just looking, we're like, okay, we'll just we'll get it like hydro seated again or something, but whew, it's looking. <laughs> A little suspicious. So I need to order some groceries because we don't have a whole lot. I have enough to make a couple dinners, but we need like stuff to make salads. We need like breakfast stuff. We just need some stuff. We need some stuff. So I might do a target pickup because we also need laundry stuff because he wants to do laundry. And I need like body wash. I need like a few miscellaneous things and I'm not trying to have fun at Target. I'm trying to stay on organization. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna place a target pickup and we need to clean this bridge.
I just got home from dropping off Bruno at the groomers and doing a quick little Target pickup. So, babe, I got stuff to do laundry if you want to do it now. Oh, wait, this said this was out of stock. It was in the room. Surprise. Surprise. I got this um, ant killer because like the traps that the insect guy put, it's helped with the counters but we still get somewhere on the trash. I was just gonna like do a little spray because it's safe for people and pets. No chemical odor, no messy residue. It had good reviews. Zevo, we'll stay tuned. Um, I got laundry stuff. I got a new scent of the scent boosters. I like the light ones. The last one we had was Ocean. So I wanna give this one a whiff and let you guys know if it's good or not. This one sounded enticing. It's Woodland Rain. Ooh, oh, yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. They all smell good, to be real. <laughs> I know, I've never smelled a bad one, but do you like this better than the, the last ocean? one was Fresh Linen or? Ocean. Ocean. I wonder if these set names are trademarked. Don't they they are. Look at it, oh, trade, trademarked. It's trademarked. Can't use it. it smells so smells good. good, yeah. Right? Mm, I like that. They're all very fresh, but like the ocean one, I'd say these are both just as good. Um, we have repurchased these multiple times now. The downy, that's not downy. This is glad. The cherry blossom scent of the kitchen bags. It masks odor so much and they smell insanely good. I can always smell them outside of the box. Highly, highly recommend. And I got a lot of this on sale at Target because they're always having sales, like household items. So if you're going to like buy a bunch of stuff, Sometimes it's worth it. We use these with our whites, the OxyClean White Revive little pods. We throw them in with our whites and it really, I think it really makes a difference. And then this is the recent um, laundry detergent we've been using. It has like one of the best reviews on consumer reports, the stain release from Tide. And that's been working really well too. <laughs> this is our laundry essentials. Um, and then I needed body wash. So I wanted to try one from Tree Hut. I really like Tree Hut products, but I've never tried their body wash. So I got the watermelon one. And then I also got the watermelon shave oil, moisturizing shave oil. So I wanted to do a little combo and see how they are. Let's see, let's give this one a whiff test as well. I do very much enjoy the Tree Hut shave oils. Like they just really moisturize your skin. I'm excited, this smells like childhood. And then of course, big thing of spring mix. It's what we do. And I think in the next vlog, I wanna try to make those viral TikTok strawberry bites that are going around. And then I just got a big thing of chicken breast. So we really didn't need that much, just like essentials, some stuff. I thought we needed, um, no, I think we have enough. Enough to get through, cause today is Thursday and we have some plans over the weekend. So we didn't need a lot, but just enough. So I will check back in with you guys when Bruno is groomed and all fresh and clean. I can't wait to snuggle him. Um, I still have been snuggling him <laughs> even though he stinks, but um, it's always the best after he's clean and blown out. Like it makes his fur all fluffy. I told her she could go a little shorter. Like last time we did a little less short, but now I'm like, it was a little too long. So we'll see, we'll see how it comes out today. I'm excited to see. And we're also done with the concrete under the deck, but we're just gonna wait for it to dry and I'll show you guys that too. It looks really good. Many hours later. Hi baby, you look so handsome. Did you nestle behind your bed? Aw, you look so cute. And of course, I can't help but get him <laughs> some treats when we go to uh, the pet store, but we needed more smart bones. I love these because they're rawhide free and he loves them. I made us turkey burgers. This is Yara's plate here for dinner with carrot chips as like carrot fries. Perfected the recipe. These are so good. Season with avocado oil spray, salt, pepper, and Old Bay. Shake it up really good. Air fry on 400 for like 10 minutes. Shake them around in between. Insanely good. Y'all thought I was being silly about the backyard? <laughs> When this guy said it'll be a small corner right here, <laughs> look at our, our our whole backyard, y'all. I literally can't. <laughs> but they were very nice about it. The guys actually ended. Oh my god, yeah, it's a lot. It's actually a lot. Um, but they put down some seed for us and they like raked it, which was very very nice. But it just wasn't quite what we expected. <laughs> like half the backyard, and now like with Bruno. 
I'm gonna have to walk him on that little patch over there. It's just a whole lot. But anyway, now the patio extends to the bottom of the stairs. And here's what it looks like now. It's really beautiful. It was all just like rocks before. There's a little bit of rocks here and here, which they didn't tell us they were doing, which I'm a little bummed about because I would have liked to take the tile all the way back here. I just like the rocks, like Bruno likes to dig in the rocks and that was kind of like the biggest reason why we did this. But at such a small area, I don't think he'll be able to dig there. If not, maybe we can get some sort of like fencing to go around it. But the majority of, you know, the rocks are gone. Um, and it's a really beautiful design. We love it. I like the dark around the edges. I like the pattern. So um, I think we're going to put some sort of like loungy stuff down here. I like that this is here now. I can, you know, do some maybe like a little table. I don't know. It'll be fun. Maybe we'll do like a patio makeover. So stay tuned. But I think I'm going to wrap up this vlog here. I know it was very random. I know it made no sense. <laughs> But hopefully you guys still enjoyed. Regular content will resume shortly, um, the next vlog. So I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.